Okay, you tell me when you're set. Harold Dow could talk to anyone. I got no problem with that. And get nearly anyone to talk to him. How do you want history to remember Mike Tyson? <laughs> Mike can kick the man. Harold will be remembered as the first correspondent to corner O.J. Simpson after his verdict. Can you understand why they're upset? Do you understand? No, I don't understand, and I don't really think it's about me. Harold Dow was a TV news pioneer, the first black reporter hired in Omaha. There were so many threats, the news director carried a gun. When I got off the air, I stumbled through this thing. I was like a deer caught in headlights, you know what I mean? But, but I stumbled through it, and I got to the newsroom, and everybody were trying to explain to these corn huskers what had just happened. What so happened to Harold yeah, was a rapid rise to CBS News, where he brought his own distinctive style. In a CBS News exclusive interview, she talked with reporter Harold Dow. In your days of captivity, what were the conditions like uh, while you were being held there? I was put in a closet and blindfolded. But the Harold we knew and loved came through when he revisited the story of a little girl left for dead by a serial killer. To see her walk into that courtroom with her chest out as she took the witness stand, uh, she was there for business. and. Uh, She did it. Harold Dow understood that living a great life was the most important exclusive of all. Peter Van Sant, CBS News, New York.